live from Las Vegas, this is Inside the Line with Marco D'Angelo for Sunday, October 18th. I'm going to preview an NFL game for you, give you a free selection for Sunday. Before I do that, let me tell you what's happening with my plays here on the Sunday card. First, I want to thank everybody that joined me yesterday for my selections as we delivered a huge game we had our 15-star college massacre game. It was only my second 15-star play of the entire football season, and what a massacre it was. Clemson rolling 38-3 over Wake Forest. What an easy winner yesterday, and we've got more big winners lined up for Sunday. The past two Sundays, our NFL selections have been dead on and I've got another big play going on Sunday. You can join me for all of my plays on Sunday featuring another Massacre game. This one's not a 15 star, but it is a triple dime play and you can pick it up. It'll be a seven star play on Sunday. Pick that game up in all of my other Sunday plays for just $30. Check it all out at pregamepros.com where you can pick up all of my Sunday plays featuring that big seven-star play. Last week, our seven-star play was the Washington Redskins who got the money against Carolina. And the week before that, we had Miami who rolled over Buffalo 38-10. Join me Sunday, another massacre play in the NFL. Now, let's get to a Sunday selection. I'm going to take a look at the Cincinnati-Houston game. Last week, Cincinnati went into Baltimore. It was a battle for first place, and the Cincinnati Bengals got the job done, winning the game on the final drive, 17-14. Now, coming into that game, the Baltimore Ravens were averaging 31 points per game and the Cincinnati defense rose to the occasion, holding them to 14 points. Now, twofold why I like the over in this game. Cincinnati had a huge effort last week. It was for first place. They now have sole possession of first place in the AFC Central Division. The, I should say the North, what we have with Cincinnati is a natural letdown spot after that big win. In teams that are in letdown spots, when they had a big defensive effort like Cincinnati did, you can expect the defense not to play at the same level as they did last week. Natural letdown coming from Cincinnati. What makes it even more of a letdown on that defense is the fact that last week the defensive coordinator for the Cincinnati Bengals lost his wife. She passed away a couple uh, days before Sunday's game. He decided to travel with the team to Baltimore to play that game last week. His team gave a monumental effort for their coach. Now, this week, it's the week after the adrenaline rush, the the team you know, rallying together around him, they're not going to have the same kind of defensive effort this week. It's just not humanly possible. Houston, on the other hand, scores a lot of points, and they give up a lot of points. I look for this game to be an absolute shootout. The over-under is 46 on this game. I see 55 or more points on Sunday in this game. The winning team will be in the 30s in this game. Take this game over the total. Again, it's 46. Take it over the total of 46. And that is my free selection for you guys as we go inside the line. Now, I'll be back next week. We'll do this again on Saturday and Sunday as we preview the weekend plays. Once again, don't forget, I've got a big NFL Massacre game going today. We've been on a nice run. College football's been phenomenal. We hit two out of three yesterday. We were 2-0 and heading into the weekend. So we're working on a 4-1 and football week. 
and again highlighted by that big 15 star i will talk to you guys next week as always this is marco d'angelo your host here on inside the line wishing you the best of luck with all of your sunday wagers talk to you next week